you are watching KSG News Explainer. In this video, we are going to talk about fortified rice distribution being approved. This is for GS Paper 3 Biotechnology. The Union Cabinet approved a scheme to distribute fortified rice under government programs. Food Corporation of India and state agencies have already procured 88.65 LMT, that is lakh tons, of fortified rice for supply and distribution. In last year's Independence Day speech, the Prime Minister had announced the fortification of rice distributed under various government schemes, including the public distribution system, that is PDS, and midday meals in schools by 2024. Now, what is rice fortification? The Food Safety and Standards Authority of India defines fortification as deliberately increasing the content of essential micronutrients in a food so as to improve the nutritional quality of food and to provide public health benefit with minimal risk to health. Various technologies are available to add micronutrients to regular rice, such as coating, dusting and extrusion. The last mentioned involves the production of fortified rice kernels from a mixture using an extruder machine. It is considered to be the best technology for India. The fortified rice kernels are blended with regular rice to produce fortified rice. Dry rice flour is mixed with a premix of micronutrients and water is added to this mixture. The mixture is passed through a twin screw extruder with heating zones which produces kernels similar in shape and size to rice. These kernels are dried, cooled and packaged for use. FRK has a shelf life of at least 12 months. Fortified rice will be packed in jute bags with the logo plus F and the line fortified with iron, folic acid and B12. That's it for this explainer. Thank you so much for watching. To join KSG in the courses and to crack the ice exam, visit ksgna.com. You can also get a PDF of this explainer on ksgna.com. Thanks for watching.